update tonight. Brothers exonerated after being convicted of murder will have to wait before being declared officially innocent. As WGN's Sean Lewis reports, both were victims of police torture under former Chicago Police Commander John Burge. It is still not clear why the judge in this case postponed it until later this week, only to say that she has one more thing to research before making her ruling. What is clear is that these brothers are ready to move forward. On a chilly March morning at the Cook County Criminal Courthouse, <laughs> brothers Sean Tyler and Reginald Henderson came to have their names cleared. What they got was another delay. Please, man, let us go. That's all we ask. The brothers were just 17 and 18 when they were convicted in a 1994 murder. Their confessions they contend coerced by detectives working under notorious former CPD commander John Burge. They were both exonerated and freed in 2021. But their petition to completely clear their names with a certificate of innocence, a COI, has been held up over the objection of Cook County State's Attorney Kim Fox and her office. I have no idea why the state believes that Sean and Reginald are innocent enough to have their convictions vacated, but not innocent enough to have a certificate of innocence. It's very backwards. It is very haphazard. This should not be so much of a fight as it often is. I know the process takes patience, but um, like, like enough is enough. The brothers, now in their mid-40s, want closure and their records clear. Henderson earned his college degree behind bars. Tyler has a clothing line, wrote six books, and is looking for a publisher. He keeps a locket of their mother around his neck. She held in long enough to see me and my brother come home. Sadly enough, when we came home, she, uh, you know, she made a transition. And uh, it's, it's... That loss and others who supported them during their incarceration remain in their hearts. She watching over you guys right now? Always. After nearly three decades, they say they will wait these three more days. We'll continue to come and we'll continue to wait because again, you know, as we as we all know from being in prison, justice is slow, but it does exist. We did reach out to the state's attorney's office today to get comment on why they objected to the certificate of innocence. They got back to us saying that they could not comment because it is pending litigation. The brothers will be back in court Thursday morning at the Cook County Criminal Courthouse. Sean Lewis, WGN News.